Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I am going to make this my introduction video. This is going to be a chit chat. Take down my soft locks with me. I've had these in since I've had okay. these in since June, so I will be taking down my four month old soft locks. And then I just wanted to do a good old chit chat. Let this be an introduction of my channel because I know that I probably have about a good 20 videos to upload and none of them have no introduction or talking about who i am so let's go ahead and get started let's get this party started hold on because i want to be in the mirror but like i don't want to be over this specific stick so it's okay so y'all this is like my new growth and stuff from four months of having soft locks i'm so ready to take these out oh and if you didn't know today is my birthday <laughs> so yes i am starting my new my second youtube channel on my birthday it will literally say created september 14th this video will be uploaded september 14th so i'm so excited about that but yes um i thought i had an hour for lunch we've been having an hour for lunch and training for like the past two weeks and now today all of a sudden we have 45 so you've got 45 minutes to take down her hair and introduce herself so we are going to I feel like I just want to take out one by one, which is probably what I'm going to do. And we'll just do it like this. And then I'll just take down one by one. I already took down one yesterday just to see what I was working with. What you working with? <laughs> what you working with? But yes, you guys. So hello. If you guys are just coming in and have not been to my first original channel, my name is Faye. Today is my birthday, Virgo Nation, Virgo. And I wanted to start this um, YouTube channel. Y'all, it's gonna be these taking these out is gonna be the death of me. I kid you not, taking these out are gonna be the death of me. But that's why I got my handy dandy scissors and I just wanna make sure that I'm not actually cutting my hair but i wanted to create this second channel because i wanted to get into vlogging we'll get back into vlogging my first channel originally started off with oh that's the end of it that's the that's the end i'm like oh, ain't no way but um my first y'all i don't i don't know Am I going to be able to talk and do this at the same time? It's given that I'm not because, oh my goodness. Oh my God. Okay, no. Okay, we're, we're good. We're we're good, right? Right? Y'all, I'm, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm looking this mirror. If I look in this mirror, you guys will be able to see. Oh! See where overthinking gets you? So was anything cut? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. I did cut. But this isn't my hair. This hair was crocheted in, right? Like I'm trying to pull it through. Y'all right, can't see the hip movement. I didn't cut my hair. Okay, so let me, let's go ahead and take this. Just I'm not going to take the actual braids down, but we're taking out the locks. But I wanted to... um create this channel because like my last channel was based on um it started off with me creating a hair video while i was on deployment that video did so happen to go viral my very first youtube video and i just went on from there but you know i did upload more hair content and then i took breaks because you guys you know being in the military and deployment and everything i also featured on that page me getting pregnant with my lucky baby my first child um, so that's on there. Oh, this is going to be easier than what I thought. Period. And I wanted to get back into vlogging. I think I've always been a content creator, um, like a natural content creator. I just never did content creating for the money, essentially. Like a lot of people are doing it now as a career and as a lifestyle. But I literally just did a lot of stuff because, you know, I did it because it was fun. And if money came within it, then money came within it. Like, 
you know, I wasn't doing it to be like, oh, I need to do it so I can make this much money or I can be well off or I can not do, not work or not go to school or anything like that. That was like never my case. Like you guys, I am a mom. I am a mommy. I am now out of the military. I did get it out of get out of the military for my child. I am someone who also suffered with postpartum depression postpartum depression postpartum depression anxiety um once i had my child um also being a veteran the things that come with being a veteran so i wanted to basically like detail my life i have a really great job i have a government job so i'm not really doing this more so for the money but i would love to do this full time for the freedom because uh things that are going on with my son it requires a lot of my time and attention and energy and so working just sometimes those two just don't coexist okay and i would love to be like also like the other content creators who just kind of like get up and go get up get their kids ready for school then come back home and then they're out running errands or something like that like you don't have to worry about clocking in clocking out taking a lunch taking a lunch break or anything like that so ooh, I really want to have that type of freedom I'm starting this channel on my birthday just to hold myself accountable and see where I can be in one year um I am posting this on my birthday it's actually the day before I'm taking my hair down I will be taking my hair down I will be getting my nails done today when I get off work and then tomorrow I will be getting my hair done but this video will be going up on my birthday um, a little bit about myself. I am from California. Yes, I am from the land. Born and raised in California. But I currently am in Texas. This is where I was stationed in the military. So this is where I have always been since I have had my child. Well, this is actually where I've spent all of my military career because of COVID happening. But, um... Yes, I am a cash budgeter. I'm into cash budgeting. That is what my first YouTube channel is. It is cash budgeting. So if you guys don't know about like the cash envelope method, um, you guys should head over there and check out some of those videos. But this channel will consist of vlogging. It will consist of lifestyle organization. It will consist of hauls because y'all, I, I for sure got some stuff to show y'all because the fact that my living room has Amazon, but like I got some stuff for me for, for myself for my birthday. I never usually do anything for myself. And so um, this year I actually like I bought myself, um, I have like a few bags in there. I bought myself some um, accessories for my camera like I bought me another lens a low-key did buy me actually another camera like I'll keep it a buck because the camera that I'm filming on right now top tier grade A but baby it is not a vlogging camera this is not something you want to carry around because of the lens it's not it's no it, it's not something you want to carry around the lens is not gonna let you be great instead it's gonna put you in a great deal of pain and Yep. <laughs> yep, I just cut my hair, y'all. I just cut my goddamn hair. Wild, wild, wild. That's wild to me. That's wild to me. That's wild to me. It's okay. It's okay. Ends were gonna get clipped anyway. It's okay. It's okay. I'm telling myself it's okay. Like I'm not gonna be crying over that little piece in a minute. But it's okay. Um, I just need to feel for what part it is I'm cutting. And I know that I am cutting. I know that I'm cutting this. But yes, I don't even know where I stopped y'all because that threw me for a damn that threw me for a loop de doop. That definitely threw me off guard. Okay, so I see my actual I have to I need to take my actual braid out this 
equation and then yes this right here is my hair we good we're good um <laughs> Me being a cash budgeter, me always doing social media. I've had a six figure business. I'm not sure if any of you guys come across, um, anybody that comes across this video has shopped with my business, Bella Cosmetics. But yes, I owned that business and I actually closed that business last year because it was just stressful. Closed that business, gave up my warehouse, and I am actually at much more peace right now, which is why. I'm feeling the need to get back into social media because I don't have, if I'm sweaty, y'all, I'm sorry. I am sweaty. But um, this is why I'm feeling the need to get back into social media because there is no pressure. I feel like you go at your own, you go at your own pace. And when you are not promoting a business or you're not, like, don't get me wrong, entrepreneurship is awesome. This looks like it's my braid and it feels like it's my braid um, entrepreneurship is awesome it is but it is very stressful and I feel like it, because of COVID COVID made I'm gonna have to look this way COVID made everyone um it made everyone it not that's not the word it made everyone wanting to it COVID created a lot of entrepreneurs because there were not a lot of jobs. So a lot of people started to tap into different opportunities, different um, different skills that they have and people monetize from it. And you know, but I do want to say entrepreneurship is not for everybody. I've had three businesses, done well with all three, three businesses and closed three businesses on my own accord. Entrepreneurship is not for everyone. This one is giving me grief, but I know this is my hair right here. And yeah, so that's like a gist of what you're going to be getting out of this channel. I really wanted to do a chit chat with me. I chatted enough, I feel like. Where are we at? We're at 12 minutes. I probably actually didn't chat a lot. But I want to probably time lapse me taking down my hair because I do... I do have to get back to work. Look at that. Hmm, can I focus that? My eyes are always like super bright. There we go. I'm just so proud. Oh, also let me just throw in there. I've been natural for about 13 years. Um, but I have always been wearing protective styles. And then for the last two years, I have only wore braids. I have not had no weaves, wigs, or anything. And so, um... For my birthday, I'm actually getting a silk press, which I'm very excited about. So now that I actually am a remote worker, I now work from home, my first remote job, I will be able to care more for my natural hair. I don't have to worry about damaging it because I have to go to work and I need to um, blend on my edges or what, whatever the case may be. I can take care of my hair more. And then if you guys do know or don't know, my business, Bella Cosmetics, was a um, all-natural skin, body, and hair care business as well as specializing in feminine care. So you don't need soaps, spray, bars, wipes, you know, all of, the, all of that. But also an extension of my business was It's in the Roots, which is like what I call, what I named my hair care products that I sold in my business, Bella Cosmetics. Well, as of June... It's in the roots is officially trademarked, like officially, uh, I said officially, 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 officially trademark, and um, which is my hair care business, and I actually have like my own shampoos, conditioners, and stuff. So I will be showing you guys the growth and the progression of my hair, promoting my, um, promoting my products and stuff. My skincare business like no longer served its purpose. I was no longer happy about it. It was just, it was just a lot. But this business, this business makes me so much, it makes me so much more happier. And I am not doing it for the revenue. I'm just doing it because I want to do it. And I won't do it the way that I did Bella Cosmetics. Do I want a warehouse right now? No, <laughs> not at all not at all i don't even want to create my own website like baby y'all to get the y'all can get these products on etsy or something like that that's that's where i that's where i'm at in life okay you can get these products in, on etsy um 
but yes I am gonna stop talking because I'm gonna time lapse this because I really need to get this out and yes I get my hair done tomorrow but I just want to be productive and get this out today so that I'm not rushing hell I can't even take this out tomorrow because if I get off at 3 30 I get my hair done at 4 what are we talking about take this out I need to take this out I, okay so I need to take this out today before my baby get home that's what it is okay so I'm going to be I have a hole in my shirt y'all this is just <laughs> this video is chaotic but it's okay so I'm gonna time lapse this and I'm going to take down my hair Okay, so I'm listening to Hold on, hold on, hold up I'm listening to the So Shameless podcast right now Love that podcast, highly recommend 10 out of 10 um, But I am figuring out an easier way to take this down And It's gonna get way easier I'm getting the hang of it Hang in there with me, y'all And this thing live with people he sees on screen. This one, I like that hat. Let me have it. Did I say let me have it? What did you say? I said I like your hat. Can I have it? And he said sure. <laughs> Can I? If Beyonce asks you for your hat, would you give it to her? Nah, this one probably. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. yeah you you said no. Especially a guy. But and I so literally. A woman but I literally that said you can say no. Reference? You can say no. Then you gonna look like a. You're going to feel kind of corny. It's your hat. You don't have to say and that. And you come in here rocking it as if this is like, oh, this is my Did thing. I wear the ancestor's hat. No. Like the 1619 hat on. Like, this is your, your, like, oh, this is my ancestor hat. Look at this hat. It's an ancestor. Just hopped in. I got options. I can pass that like stocking. Just joshing. I'm spending this holiday locking. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top ten. I can put the ball in the end zone. Put a bad bitch in the friend zone. This shit sound like an intro jet song. Give me that tempo. So cool, get fooled with the shit. Told her don't let her friend zone. In the building, I move like a dime. Even better cheat me a Vincenzo. So.
on me Leave all of your things, yeah You can stop at Gucci, stop at Louis V, yeah Call me, fly you out to grief Full speed, so for the belly, yeah Call me, leave all of your things, yeah You can stop at Gucci, stop at Louis V, yeah Call me, fly you out to grief Full speed, so for the belly, yeah
done. I'm happy. Let me move the camera to a more suitable area because as you guys seen, your girl cut two of her braids. I cut two of my braids. I cut two. Hold on. Let me, let me get this moved over. I cut two of my braids, y'all. I cut two braids. I cut two braids in the front. It's so ghetto. It's so ghetto. <laughs> I'm gonna have to sweep my floor. For sure gonna have to sweep my floor. Cause I just don't like when there's hair everywhere. But I cut two of my braids. Let me show y'all. I'm so sad because they have to be two braids in the front. And I look like Coolio right now. And it's like you can see. <laughs> you can see it. It's obvious. So here is one. I cut this one. I cut this one as short as this goes crazy um and I can't find the other one which I'm low-key happy about because I mean it's not never mind <laughs> I cut two I cut two like in the same area that goes crazy it's okay I know how to, one thing I can do baby I can grow some hair so I'm for sure going to be able to grow this back Oh my goodness. And I want to take <laughs> I want to take this down because I'm not going to the nail shop looking like this. But let me just take down this one cuz I want to see what it look like. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, like straight up cut it. Like straight cut, like blunt cut. Oh, and that's actually some hair. That's actually a long strand of hair in between like is this a long strand or is this like wrapped up in something hold on oh no this is this is a strand of my hair so as you can see where it's cut and where it's supposed to be oh wow oh wow oh wow oh wow oh wow yeah i'm yeah yeah mm -mm. Mm -mm. I'm sad about that <laughs> and so I am definitely going to take this down I'm going to take this down off camera and then I'll come back and show you what it looks like when I'm done because I got to get back to work so I am back I have taken down my hair I've tried to do my best in detangling it to the best of my ability but i will be getting it done tomorrow and so after four months oh look at me just collecting after four months this is how much i've lost which to me honestly is not bad considering cutting two braids in half <laughs> considering all things but yes scalp feels good i will definitely vlog all of my maintenance so yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on all of my social media channels. And in the meantime, in the between time, I'll see y'all in my next vlog.